Carnegie Mellon University's Iris rover is bolted in and ready for its journey to the moon. The tiny rover passed a huge milestone on Wednesday, December 1st, when it was secured to one of the payload decks of Astrobotic's Peregrine Lunar Lander, which will deliver it to the moon next year. Weighing in at about four pounds, the shoebox-sized Iris aims to be the first American, student-developed, smallest, and lightest rover to land on the moon. It is equipped with cameras to facilitate both its guidance and scientific observations of the moon's terrain and rock formations. Work to integrate the Iris rover with the Peregrine lander started Monday inside the clean room at Astrobotics' state-of-the-art headquarters in Pittsburgh. Technicians and the CMU integration team delicately secured Iris to the underside of one of Peregrine's payload decks. Before Iris could be attached to the lander, the rover had to pass a series of tests to ensure that it could fit in its allotted space, withstand the vibrations expected during launch, endure the vacuum of space, and survive the temperatures expected on the moon. The CMU team tested its electronic emissions to ensure that they do not interfere with the lander or other payloads. For more information on IRIS, visit irislunarrover.space.